now if you look in these days, many people have divided themselves. Mm. They have restricted themselves to some, like let's say group A, group B, and group three, if you understand why we do not have the unity in our Muslim Ummah. This is the root cause, this is the root cause. But let's say uh, we have four mothers. How many of you know that? Brother, who may, how many? Excuse me, brother. Who knows that we have four mothers, right? Yes. We have, no. You're going to say it? Yes, we, uh, we have uh, four Hanafi? parents that uh, they follow as Muslims. And um, there is some talk about it. Some other we have four mothers, right? Yeah. Like, like um, yes, Imam Abu Hanifa, yeah. Imam Shafi, Imam Ibn Hanbal, and Imam Malik. May Allah bless them all. They were the great scholars. They were the great scholars. And they were the best people came on the earth to guide people who were misguided. But none of them told anyone to follow me or restrict yourself to me. They never told that. Let's say how people are divided. They restricted themselves. You're listening, you follow me? They restricted themselves. Like, uh, let's say uh, you are brother, he's Hanfi, yeah. he's Shafi, yeah. he's Humbly, and he's Maliki, right? Yeah. So we have a four different groups. Yeah. But what if you just remove your label? Yeah. Then you're gonna go back to Kalima. Yeah. See, that's a problem. He restricted himself, he restricted himself, he restricted himself, and he restricted himself. Yeah. So what happens, how the shaitan deceived the people, the later generation? All the imams, right? Let's say for an example, if I have a, if somebody asks me, can I drink a water in a cup of, in a cup? I said, yes, that's permissible. Mm -hmm. If somebody comes to me, can I drink a water in a jug? I will say, yes, that's permissible. Mm -hmm. If somebody comes to me, can I have a drink of water in a bowl? It's permissible. Mm -hmm. So cup, we have a glass, we have a bowl, and we have a jug, mm -hmm. okay? So what happened, these were the options, but these were permissible. They did, they, they, okay, you can do that because this is not contradicting Quran, this is not a contradicting Sunnah, this is permissible, you can do that. But what happens, not that generation, but the next generation, they came, and one of the person came was in shaitan. He came in the face of a human being to misguide people. And how did he misguide you? He came to this brother, he said, Imam Abu Hanifa, may Allah bless him, used to drink a water in cup. Now his son, now his son, now his grandchildren, all are using in a cup. But what was the, let, let's go back now. The first thing was to drink, you can, you have the, you are, you are permissible to drink a water in a cup, in a glass, in a jug, in a bowl, however you want. But do not restrict yourself just to stick with the glass. You're not restricted with the cup. You're not stuck with that. You understand my point, what I'm saying? Yes, yes, yes. You know, because they differ between each other. But people later on generation, they restricted themselves. They restricted themselves, actually. That's how the people divided. So this is what my mission is to let uh, tell the Muslim to remove your label and go back. If somebody asks who you are, what mother you follow, we say we don't follow no madhab. Let's say, let me ask a question. What was the mother of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? What was the madhab? No madhab, he was a Muslim. And if you know, all the prophets came from Adam Alayhi Salaam up to the Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. They had the same madhab to worship one Allah and just follow the commandment, what is halal and what is haram. And do not restrict yourself with the one mother. <laughs>